Hey y'all, welcome to Once the Buzz, and we're here today at Klaus Brewery. So to give you a little history of uh, Klaus, they opened in 2018 um, under the brewmaster Thomas Lemke and his family and friends. And um, what's interesting about this brewery, they put more of an emphasis on their German and European style beers. All right, y'all. So got a flight. First beer on my flight here. This is gonna be the Pilsner Fest. Hmm. Very crisp. I like the taste of it. So next beer on this flight, this is their lager here called One Hellas of a Lager. Mm. That's really good. Very soothing taste. Next beer on this flight, I have a Kolsch this time. This one's the Kaiser Kolsch. It's light. It's almost like not a cider kind of taste, but it's pretty light. It's very for smoothing and refreshing. All right, fourth beer on this flight. It's the the Hefeweizen they have, they Edelweizen. it. Mm. It's got a little malty there, but all right, y'all. Like this beer on this flight. This one's a Marston called the Dermdel Dropper. Hmm. Hmm. It's a very good Oktoberfest. It's not very overpowering. It's pretty good. Alright, y'all. So there's a six beer on this flight. Some for the last one. This one's a Dunkel called Dunkel Breaking My Heart. Hmm. It's a little chocolate in this. Not too bitter. So final thoughts on Klaus. Pretty cool spot. It's out here in um, Jersey Village, so for anybody in this area, I definitely recommend it. I would say out of five pints, give it 3.75. Good beer selection. They have wine in it as well. I just found out they have a lot of events that are here on a weekly basis. Um, I came here via Groupon, so that anytime I recommend to y'all, um, as far as finding breweries, check Groupon because you can find some good deals like I did today. Um, overall, I really like the place, clean bathrooms, food, um, they have food trucks here and have snacks so it's also bring your own as Thanks well. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe and don't forget to follow your boy at What's the Buzz.